My name is Charlie. I am a mother of five, four I've given birth to. So I've been pregnant almost four years of my life. I have nursed almost nine years. So this body has taken a toll for sure. So I've decided that it is time to fix her up because I just want my body back. I had my first child when I was 16 and she divided my abs so they've never been able to go back together therefore I'm gonna have to have muscle repair I'm gonna have a full tummy tuck and I'm also gonna have a breast augmentation and um, this is happening in just a few months so I'm trying to just prepare for it um, there's a lot that goes into it to prepare mentally physically and um, I'm just thankful that my family is being very supportive through this and my friends they understand you know what my body's been through and what I would like to see to make me happy. Um, so again, I'm doing this for myself and not anyone else. So if you're considering this, please watch this and see what the journey is like. Everyone is different. Every healing time is going to be different. I've literally been doing so much research, stalking other people who've had this done, uh, through TikTok and YouTube and any source I can. I'm already part of groups and Facebook to see their journeys and their struggles. So I'm just trying to really understand the full thing. It's not an instant bam, you know, it's going to be a lot. So um, it's not going to be an easy journey, but I do want to document this and share this if you're thinking about going through this. I am 148 pounds right now, and I think I'm 5'4" could be off I don't know I'm kind of short but and I'm you know a little thicker for my frame than I normally am so the first step was for me to really decide to do this and commit to it and then also to find the right surgeon so I found a doctor that's in Fairhope Alabama his name is Dr. James Kohler and um, I set up a consultation and I was very nervous, even though, you know, I've been naked and revealed my body so many times within hospitals, uh, given birth, you know, everything is exposed at that time. Um, and my closest friend has always been my OB. Can you know. I introduce everybody to Dr. Nelson? She's going to be okay with that? I have no idea. Does it, I'm the boss of today. And, ooh, pressure. I'm 10 centimeters. Pressure. Dr. Nelson's always at your cervix. Know, anytime I need anything I go to him um, so this is gonna be nice to have a new relationship with the doctor and so my husband and I went in to the consult and I'm so sorry um, my husband and I went into the consult and I didn't know exactly how it was gonna be if it was gonna be uncomfortable for him or me um, but it was actually really nice and so you know I they gave me a robe to put on. I revealed my body to him. He made me feel very, very comfortable and very professional. And he is more than just, oh, I want to be a D cup or whatever. It's about CCs. And so I'm like, I don't know what that means. So we tried on different size implants and there's so many different implants you can choose from. So it's really doing research throughout the whole thing high profile low profile and hopefully I'll be able to get back into his office and show you guys what the implants look like and the one that um, I decide to go with um, now he said that my breasts are like nice and that I don't have to have a lift um, it's just going to be the implants but for more fullness because again you know the sisters are coming over here and over here and it's just you know I'm ready to be normal so um, and my tummy is taking a toll clearly you know I'm never going to be able to have that ab definition no matter how hard I worked out I'm not currently working out that hard yet but I intend to um, I'm trying to get my body ready now and take vitamins which I'll share later with you what all I'm taking um, to prepare for this as well um, but yeah, so the doctor reviewed my body. We decided on lipo on the back front and then full tummy tuck again, muscle repair, and then the 
breast augmentation. So that is the game plan as of now. And so um, it was not uncomfortable for my husband either. He talked to both of us and uh, he stayed in the room with me. It was just very, very nice, beautiful office, very, very professional. So I'm really excited about that. On the next video that I'm going to post, um, I hope you guys follow if you, this is something you're interested in or you just want to see what it's like. Um, but I want to show you my current body and just tell you a little bit more about that. And then I'm going to document the whole entire thing um, as much as my surgeon, surgeon will allow. And um, so come along with me and let's get this done.